Help. Engaged. Greetings everyone, in this episode, we take a look at NVIDIA's Hairworks effect, and ask the question, is it worth switching on? As you can see here, we have a side-by-side -side comparison. Take a moment, to see the differences, and make up your own mind, and then, I will let you know what I think about this. This is the PC version of the game, and this footage was captured after the version 1.03 patch. You can tell, by the fact that Geralt, has a darker beard. Before the patch, it was the same color as his hair. Okay, I think this is a good place to pause the footage and compare. In the footage on the left, where hair works is on, the hair looks finer, and tidier. On the right, however, where hair works is off, the hair not only looks more cartoony, but also scruffier. Now let's take a look at the hair from the side. It seems to me, that since the hair is scruffier with hair works off, there's more hair movement on the right. On the left, with hair works on, the hair seems more settled, almost like it had recently been blow dried with the hair dryer. As discussed in my previous video, hair works, can have a very significant impact on your frame rate. Even the most powerful GPU can lose 20 frames per second, if there are a lot of hairy frackers on screen. And here's the reason why. Yes, 8 times MSA is used, no wonder there is such a decrease in performance. So, as we look at the hair from yet another angle, what is the answer to the question I asked earlier? Should you enable NVIDIA hair works? The answer is quite simple. Yes, if your gaming rig can handle it, and no, if your rig cannot. If you are not getting smooth gameplay, then turn off hair works. That's my advice. Besides, there's not really that much difference most of the time, especially from a distance. It's just a gimmick, designed to make you upgrade your hardware. I provided quite a few facts about NVIDIA hair works, on screen, but if you want to know more, you can read about it on NVIDIA's website. I will include a link in the video description below. Anyway, that's all we've got time for, so please remember to comment, thumbs up and subscribe, if you like this video or found it helpful. This is Blade, and it's goodbye from me.